Henry. All right. Henry, stay. Stay. Stay right there. Mama's got to do this really quick. All right, so I'm going to do the pelvic curl, the one of the first fundamental building blocks of Pilates. Actually, one of the foundation core workout movements. Um, so yeah, follow along with me and let's get started. You're going to want to start lying supine in neutral spine position with your legs parallel and your knees bent and your feet relaxed and your arms by your sides. You're going to inhale on no movement and exhale when you lift. You are also going to want to draw your abdominals in when you're curling your pelvis up and spine off of the mat. Our muscle focuses here is abdominals and hamstrings. You're going to want to keep this in mind for, there's three things that we want to keep in mind for the objectives, which is spinal, rotate, spinal articulation, I'm sorry, hamstring control, and pelvic lumbar stabilization. So I'll cue you when to return to neutral pelvis position and as we lift off the mat to maximize our lumbar flexion. So here we go. I'll do about five of them and that will be the example of what a pelvic curl is. So here we go. Inhale. <laughs> Exhale. Stop it, Henry. Inhale. Exhale. Oh. Yep, you don't want to lay under there. Inhale. Maximize that lumbar flexion. Keep your pelvic stable and focus on your hamstring control. Inhale. Exhale. Spinal articulation. So I think that was like three right now, so let's do two more. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. So that is the pelvic curl. One of the first steps in the building blocks of Pilates. Sorry about Henry, hope he wasn't much of a distraction. He's always with me, so I'm learning to work with him, and I just love him. I love you, Henry. Okay, that's enough for today. Hope you gained something from this, and hello. see you next time on my next video. Alright, bye. Me, myself, and I, or you.